So what you're seeing here, I'm going to put as an example. I'm going to start to make a lot of these videos. I don't give a fuck if you can keep up. I'm putting them out there. You want to learn? Here it is. Here's your opportunity. So what we're seeing here is called an android, right? Robotoid, robotic human, not robotic portal. That's different. Robotic portal is different to robotoid. Okay? I've explained android and robotoid. They're like similar, the same sort of thing. Updatable androids are a little bit different to um, robotoids. They're kind of like old fashioned. They're the ones that you see breaking down on like TV and, and news broadcasts on YouTube or whatever. The new version is updatable androids, right? It's because you are in a simulation where the background is mechanical, okay? And so I'm going to show you soon where the reptilians live and their, the an their ancestors are the dinosaurs, right? And they live on a much larger section of continents you know a continent like australia is the largest continent on our section of the flat earth map and it is not the conventional map that you've all seen and come accustomed to there's a different much larger map and i'm going to show you that soon and there's actually a different larger land mass that we've found and i'm telling you that's where they live and they have, you know, reptilians, and they, this is planet Snakedos, where you are, planet Snakedos, and they have worked with the grey aliens to form our technology net. So that's why you see the little uh, dinosaur reptile when the internet breaks, and it says, oh, sorry, the, the web page is broken, and you see the little reptile. Because they, they are on a larger land mass than us. It's, I can't remember, it looks like two to three times larger. It's, a, it's about double the size or something than the world that we are in. Our continents, you know, Europe, Russia, N North America, South America, Australia, Africa, right? Um, there's a much larger land mass. The world is much larger than you think, and that's where they live. And they're, you know, their ancestors are the dinosaurs who ruled for a very long time. Uh, no dinosaurs exist anymore. They've turned to the reptilians that we know. And they have advanced multi-dimensional ability. But it's fourth dimensional. It is not higher. <clears throat> then there are greys, which are in turn higher. And we'll talk about that separately. But... Uh, that's how they're able to create uh, six-dimensional technologies and implement them on a third-dimensional scale. And we'll talk about all this as the channel progresses. I'm dropping this video on you because I think, you know, there's enough people on this channel now to, who are ready to, to hear this and, and who I can show this to. Early in the channel, I've not been sure. But I've seen comments, that's why it's important that you guys comment on the videos. Pretend I'm stupid and tell me what you think. Alright, because I want to know where you're up to so I can drop it on you. Alright, and I'm going to start dropping this shit now. I'm going to drop this shit because it's fucking hot. It's very hot shit that we're dropping. Alright, so this is an android talking to a reptile. He's actually a... Um, you could say a dragon, but a vampire. You'll see the guy on the left, the, the president of uh, Doctors something. If we continue to watch, they say what he's, what he's the head of or whatever. But um, yeah, this is an android, and you can see by the blinking. They all blink the same, they all react the same, and it's very mechanical and obvious. And how come I can't even put on this face? I can't even take on this mechanical formation watch oh and just before we watch uh this is what i wanted to say besides all of that which was kind of like uh you know uh, introduction to what i wanted to introduce you to right now 
so you can understand what I'm talking about and the series we're going to go into up this is all going to be part of the uh, updated reptilian information playlist uh, because I think people are very far behind in the whole movement of organic portals, reptilians and all this conspiracy, blah blah blah, whatever you want to call it. I think you're all very far behind. Not everyone, but you know, when I say all it means, you know, most. So I think almost everyone is very far behind on this and I'm going to now start to drop this. So check out the reptilians playlist, the updated reptilian information playlist. On this channel because I'm going to start to drop things that you can't understand that are very far ahead of their time you may not even figure them out for you know several years but I'm gonna sew it together so hopefully you do and you can see it like when I talk about the green screen video that's coming I already made it a year ago still haven't published it because I've been waiting for the time to drop this and now it's time in 2022 Oh, I'm just I'm judging by the environment and the war and stuff and your comments. I can feel this thing and when to drop this stuff. Don't forget I have 1,000 videos saved. When I was camping for those last few years at Camping Merindia, right? Remember that in 2020, 2021? I actually was making, like I've told you guys, 10 videos a day. I'm way ahead and donations have put me behind the more you donate the more I can just release and drop these videos because that's what's been holding me back and your like button presses and views so if you just share this crap just put it somewhere just put these fucking videos somewhere man put them on a page it doesn't matter who views them because it just works the algorithm that's all we need to do to push this out work the algorithm don't make me go back to these websites where I can put fake likes, fake comments, fake views on with auto clickers. I can run this whole channel by myself. I don't really need anybody, but it's much easier with you guys, right? So what I'm about to show you is um, how I've I've been studying this very carefully. And you'll see this on major major networks, major news networks, so to speak you'll see always the same thing the android is always interviewing the reptile and so what I can conclude from this and this is what I'm trying to teach you is that they are subservient right the androids are subservient to to the reptilians and I thought about that well why is that oh, maybe because they're the creators of them all right, don't worry, we're going to drop more videos soon. The refugees in particular. Uh, uh, we have a peasants at the border. Back. The health and safety of the refugees in particular. He's an uh, android. Uh, we have this is a reptile. at the border with Moldova and also in uh, Poland and other neighboring uh, countries. Uh, the health situation of the arrivals uh, is, is a vampire. Fine. We have uh, regular medical uh, problems. Right, so you saw the, the blinking I'm talking about on the Android. They all do it the same. And it's just this heavy blinking. Can you see what he is telepathic telepathically transmitting with his heavy blinking? I am subver subservient, tell me master, go back, rewind the video, search this video for yourself and watch it in slow-mo, whatever you have to do to figure it out, take as long as you fucking need, you simp fuck, you're in a prison and this, what you're looking at is called a vampire, but they're reptiles, they're reptoids, that's the wave form should I say it slower? Wave form. You should indeed read David Icke's book on this. And guess what? One of the subscribers, Mario. Thank you, Mario Jakulta. From, uh, where are you from? Oh, I'm sorry, mate. Uh, Czech? I don't know. Sorry where you're from. Serbia, Czech, or Eastern Europe, or something like that up there. Apologies. But thank you, Mario uh, Jakulita, or... Mario J. Anyway, and you've got yourself a free organic portals handbook for allowing me into your Amazon account 
to read all the Kindle books uh, that you purchased and I read David Icke's book and I have to agree with David Icke that is how you talk about it you do not talk about it like Truth Dog Channel this fucking idiot Australian guy Truth Dog and his videos on reptilians you can learn something from his channel it can help but listen to the previous sentence I just said there's a reason why I talk disrespectfully about people. It's, oh, I, I, I hate Truth Dog. No. It's the information I don't ad hominem attack. When I don't ad hominem attack people, it's not what I do because I'm not an organic portal. I don't ad hominem. I attack the information. Because I'm trying to straighten this shit out for you. You should be fucking thankful. Anyway. So this is a vampire. He's got reptilian waveform. Don't worry, we're going to talk about it if you don't understand, and this is all too deep for you right now. Uh, with uh, observing uh, within this uh, type of uh, population arriving to the border, like hypothermia.